Never Nerd Tori here. How are we? I hope you're all doing well. For me, it feels like a really long time since I have sat down and like talked with you guys. Because before I went on holiday, I like did some like mass filming just so I could like get myself covered. And obviously I went to Morocco for a week. I've been home for just over a week. And now I'm getting back into the groove of filming again. So it feels ages since I've sat down and talked to you guys. For you, it's only been like a few days because I could try to keep my schedule as much normal as I could. But for me, it feels like it's been a while. How are you? How have you been? So if you haven't already seen my previous vlog, I went to Morocco for a week. It was my first time there. Absolutely beautiful country. Really, really loved it. It, Morocco marked my 26th country and oh my god why can I never count how many continents I've done Europe Asia Oceania North America now Africa okay so it marked my fifth continent I don't know why I can't get that number in my head why can't I keep five I can keep 26 countries in my head but I can't keep five continents in my head it's really not that hard Tori there's only seven continents I've done five. <laughs> Quite cool, I'm impressed with that. So before I went away and I was sorting out my YouTube schedule, I didn't have this video planned because I wasn't sure how much I was going to be buying, but I, I, I picked up a few things. So this will probably be one of the shorter hauls. It won't be like a, you know, like a Disney trip haul where like it goes on for ages. It's only a small haul, but I thought you'd still appreciate seeing what I got and there is one thing that you're probably not expecting in this haul but it's me of course i managed to sneak it somehow i will save that till the end <laughs> but yeah without further ado this is everything i brought in morocco i think first we'll start off with these i'm wearing them i got some earrings at the airport let me just take take them out I need it's not gonna focus i need something to hold it up against hang on no that's pink <laughs> i can't get a pink earring to focus on a pink tablet what am i doing there you go just hold it up against my notebook to get it to focus. So yeah, I got this. They had so many colours. But I got a little pale pink one. I thought they were really cute. It also had a bright pink version. Uh, but I thought it would blend in with my hair. And I like having pale pink things just to like kind of like contrast with my bright pink hair. I can't get the backpack on now. Yeah, I thought they were really cute. I really liked them. And oh, because it's been a while, I can't remember all the pricing. Um, I think these were 50 dirham and now I'm going to have to remember what the exchange rate is. So the, how we found it, because I think it works out as divided by 12 gets it into pounds, but I don't know about you, but I can't divide things by 12 in my head. So the easiest thing is if you divide it by 10, it gets it into euros and then the pound is just a little less than the euro. So, these were 50 dirham, which makes it about 5 euros, so around £3, £4? That's me and my maths. But yeah, we had some time to spare before the flight, so, and the Moroccan currency is called, is a closed currency, so you can't get it outside of Morocco and you shouldn't really take it out so we had some money left over that like we need we couldn't take back with us so I got some earrings yeah I thought I'd do those first because they're what I'm wearing oh what should I do next I'll do one of my favorite things I saw these in so many gift shops but this particular one I only saw in one shop and it was the one I really wanted <laughs> it's me of course I had to get a plushie and so many gift shops had them just little camels but all of the gift shops, they didn't have the hats. They all had like a bit of fluff on the fluffy hair on the head. But I saw this one and it had a hat on and I didn't see any other ones with hats on. And I I like the hat. And yeah, all they had so many like different ones in different colors. There was a pink one with like purple stars on it, which I was tempted to get. But I thought this one would be like a better souvenir because like it says Morocco on the camel and it has the flag on his little hump. And he has a hat. <laughs> I got him on my day trip into Marrakesh and he was 40 dirhams, so four euros, around two, three pounds. As soon as I saw him with a hat and all the others didn't have hats, I was like, he needs to have a hat. <laughs> also from Marrakesh. So I was there end of January, beginning of February. And obviously these are, I can't wear these for like a few months here in England. 
but I can't wait to wear them in like spring summertime. Just these really cute sandals. I don't you just think the colours are just so me. <laughs> just bright tassels. The tassels match in with my earrings and I love that. Yeah, I just thought these were really cool. There was so many on the stall and these weren't actually the ones I was looking at. The ones I was originally looking at were these exact same like colours and tassels but the straps crossed over each other but he only had them in a size five I think. No, he but he only had them in a size six and they fitted but I like comfortably needed a seven and so he dug around his stool like because they were all like heaped up on a cart and he he dug around and found these ones and I was like yeah th literally they're it was the exact same ones except the others were like crisscrossed but yeah it was I just loved the tassels and the colours so yeah these were 30 dirhams so three euros one or two pounds I can't wait to wear these in the summer I have so many dresses and outfits that they're gonna go with. So, I have one last thing that I got. I got this on, so the Thursday of our trip, we did like a mini Sahara tour in like a Jeep and we stopped in the morning for a pit stop in a little village for like 20 minutes and we had a look at like some of the shops and we walked, we were walking down one of the alleys and something caught the corner of my eye, but I kept on walking. And then once it registered in my head what I had seen, I literally backstepped. Like I didn't turn around. I like did, you know, just walked backwards and then looked into the shop and I was like, oh my God. <laughs> you can't take me anywhere. You honestly can't take me anywhere. I found Winnie the Pooh in Morocco. <laughs> Who saw that coming? It's a teeny tiny backpack but it was 35 dirhams so a couple of pound, two, three pound. Obviously I am not going to fit this on my back but I was thinking I might see if I can get creative and turn it into a crossbody. I don't know. I'm gonna do something with it because obviously I can't put that on my back, <laughs> but I got so excited seeing Winnie the Pooh. Like I can't even remember the name of where we were because we were literally, we were driving for like a few, few hours and then just stopped like to stretch our legs. I don't know where we were, but I found Pooh. <laughs> so yeah, the pouch has got Pooh's face and then it says Pooh up here with a B. It's a good, good storage amount of storage. So yeah, I'm gonna figure out get some like yellow ribbon or something and turn it into a crossbody but yeah <laughs> i was not expecting to find any winnie the pooh but i did it i amaze myself sometimes so yeah other than bits of food and stuff like that that is everything i brought was in morocco i told you it was only a small haul but yeah just to kind of finish off my little moroccan playlist i have put my pack with me the vlog and obviously this video into one playlist. I was very surprised I was able to fit all the vi all the vlog clips into one video. So if you have not watched that, it'll be up in the cards for you to go and watch. But yeah, that is everything I brought. So yeah, just a quick little video showing you what I got. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know which item was your favorite. Did At the beginning of the video, did you guess one of the people was gonna be in it? <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, please do pop that thumbs up button. And if you'd like to see more from what, do click subscribe down below. And while you're down there, don't forget to ding the notification bell. You might as well. You're already down there. And I'll see you guys real soon. Bye!